So hello guys, uh, today is Wednesday uh, and I'm here with the uh, current leader of the competition, José Rebelo from Portugal. Uh, he's, uh, can you tell me a little bit, I mean, uh, how old you are, uh, your, your flying experience, World Cup experience and how you feel about this uh, winning World Cup and then we'll go to how you did it. Okay, so I fly for 14 years now, but I spent my first 10 years flying at the beach. Only from 2015, I started to doing to do thermal flying and competing. I did my first PwC in Portugal uh, in 2015, uh, but still without a competition wing. After that, uh, I did uh, more three World Cups plus Super Final 2017. Uh, and this is the second time I'm here in France. I was in the last PwC here in France. Uh, and I enjoyed it a lot. I enjoyed a lot this place. Uh, I, I'm very happy to return here. And I know this is the second most difficult competition in paragliding. So for me winning uh, the first task and now it's we're going for the fourth day I'm still leading so that's and, and having done that in such a nice place uh, for me it's very rewarding and I'm very happy with that yeah yeah what do you, what do you mean second most uh, important competition you know uh, most difficult, most competitive. What's the most difficult? The super final. Oh yeah, of course. <laughs> Sorry. Still the World Cup. Yeah. Okay, good. Uh, it was uh, no problem for you to, to reach, reach or that big ridge at full speed? Uh, or maybe not full speed, I don't know, how, how fast were you going? Uh, yeah, pretty much. I think I only did two thermals, uh, the, the last task. Uh, I like a lot uh, fast races, that's the ones I like the most, so I enjoyed it a lot. Although we could have had a bigger task, but still okay. Uh, it's the second time I crossed that ridge, it was pretty spectacular the last time, the two years ago. And at that time I was uh, more um, afraid, because I know that we were in the leeward side, uh, so I was really apart going with a safe distance but uh, after flying that time this time I was more confident so I would be able to go in uh, faster and still it's a little bit tricky but it was okay and it's pretty spectacular also yeah yeah the gliders, gliders now are, are safer at, at high speed I think they're optimized for that and, and also closer to the ridge maybe it's safer because the further away you got, the more wind you got yeah, from the top. Yeah, exactly. At the end, I was really close to the ridge, and mm. it was okay. Yeah, and yes, I noticed that improvement. I had an Enzo two, now I have an Enzo three, and I feel very good with this wing, going full speed. Uh, I didn't have any problems with the wing, so I'm really happy, and it's really fun uh, to compete with these wings nowadays. All right. You you like uh, cross country, or you prefer competitions uh, more? What's I like a lot cross country. I've done some really nice cross country flights. I actually did the spectacular flight that is imprinted in my memory with uh, about 200 uh, vultures. So that Together. was, yes, in the same thermal. So that was pretty incredible experience. So we, I have right. some pretty nice cross country flights. But right now what I prefer the most is to do competitions and high level competitions. The competition that I like the most is the super final. It's yeah. spectacular to have so many great pilots flying together, all uh, in a gaggle and we can do almost impossible things together. That's amazing. I feel like a, like a biker gang. Yeah. Unstoppable. <laughs> yeah, it's amazing. Okay, so how do you see uh, for the next day? Do you think you're going to have a lot of wind maybe uh, for two days maybe and then the last day perfect, no wind? Uh, what's best for you? You're from Portugal, it's a windy place. Maybe it's good for you, I don't know. What do you think? Uh, yeah, well, I really like the conditions here. So from what I saw, the conditions will improve throughout the rest of the competition. So that will be good. But I actually don't see and don't trust that's mu that much the, the weather, so yeah. I don't pay that much attention because I will see each day how the conditions are, analyze it in the air, and then we'll see how we can go from there. Can, can you spot the pilots 
you can you see who's who in the air? Do you know who you look for? And no, actually, uh, the last year I didn't do any PwC. I'm here with a wild card. <laughs> <laughs> it's a very wild card. Yeah, so I don't even have ranking for this one. Not even Portugal, really close okay. for the ranking Portugal. I think I will have to get another wild card oh, to yeah. be there. You get the wild card from Flatmaster? Uh, actually, from Winds. All oh, right. Uh, Right. Yeah. You get good connections. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Um, so, um, I, yeah, th I don't know. Of course. Oh. Cross country is really good for landscape and racing is really nice because of uh, the, the power maybe of the gang or gaggle. Yeah, I like all the game. It's uh, like a psychological game, but it's it puts a lot of. Besides all the aspects of performance that you must max out, it has a lot of strategy, so you put in practice everything that you can know and do in paragliding, so that's pretty amazing. Or well, maybe you want to say hello to your friends in Portugal, uh, this is your time? Yes, I, it's been great to have all the support, that's uh, pretty important in the keeping up the motivation, and it's really nice to feel all my friends, the paragliding community, family, everyone, my instructor uh, from the paragliding school, uh, the wind team also. So it has been uh, really nice to have all the people. You get a lot of SMS, a lot of messages. Yeah, good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It has been great. <laughs> Portugal yeah. is cheering now. Making history in Portuguese paragliding. Oh, it's yeah. Remaking. Because we've, <laughs> we've got some uh, good Portuguese pilots. Yeah, huh? Virgilio, yeah, so mm -hmm. they're pretty good. They're yeah. still pretty good. We and then the, uh, Amerigo is yes, pretty good. Yes, we had Amerigo. That's not uh, already between us. But uh, yeah, yeah, we have some paragliding legends in Portugal. It's yep. very nice to be part of that also. Yeah, yeah. All right. Thank you, Jose. Huh? Yeah. Uh, bon voir, huh? <laughs> da manhã, or uh, maybe today? Yeah. Hoje, bon. <laughs> Hoje, bon. Hoje, muito bon. <laughs> Ciao.